Hello and welcome back. Just gonna place the storage box I made at the end of the last one and then take care of some inventory issues. Oh nice, there's a crate over there already. But anyways, I'm gonna just try and survive day three here. I'm gonna make one of those wooden stove type things, I guess, by the end of this episode, hopefully. And then uh, try and get myself into a good position to survive day number four. Yeah, I don't think that stove will be too hard to accomplish today. I guess the hardest part is just to try and make sure I have enough protein and carbohydrates to survive. More bears over there. I'm just going to jump in the water and avoid him. Hopefully find some kelp along the way. see any close to the edge here. More fiber. Need lots of cordage. Oh, there's some crates over there. he ran before I could line up a shot. I should have crouched. I didn't see any more crates over there. Some medic medicinal plants here though. It's annoying when I edit a video and I can see that I missed a crate. It's probably happened already. More fiber. Gotta take it whenever I see it. There's a chicken. Got him. Nice, some nails. Just gonna eat this fish. I'm not sure how long before it goes bad. I definitely don't want it going bad in my backpack while I'm at half protein. I was just about to say, I haven't seen a bear for a few minutes. But then I see one up over there.
trying not to grab every tree, but I do need trees. Necessary evil in this game. And you see trees, grub trees, medicinal herbs, and fiber. You gotta take it. A carrot over here, I think? Yeah. I going to shoot him if he came at me, but I probably will need to grab one today anyway. see any crates. I still gotta remember to make a pickaxe. Finally, there's one. Oh, nice. Take bullets. I gather today it will leave me in a good situation for tomorrow. I hope. Oh. He ran away before I noticed him. I was just staring at these rocks for crates. I don't want to mess with a bear until I have like a shotgun or something. Nice, got him. Getting a little better at that. Another grizzly over there. Gotta get my grubs for my fishing overnight. It'll be nice when I can build up some food and store it without it going bad. I think I saw a refrigerator in that base unit there. More fiber. I wish my guy was more talented at making cordage and didn't need so much fiber to do it.
I don't want to go too far up into the snow right now. I probably don't have the weapons to tangle with some of the animals that are probably up there. I imagine they're stronger. I would assume they're stronger. Oh, finally some steel. I haven't seen much of that today. Lots of meat today so far. The way it's squealing when you pick it up, it just makes you feel guilty. And a miss. Sound like my arrow broke too. It made a different sound. Definitely a breaking sound. Okay, maybe I'm not getting better at that. At least that arrow didn't break. Yeah, just to save bullets. I should pull the wolf over with an arrow and then that might save me a bullet or something like that. I was going to butcher those animals, but then I thought it better not in case it goes bad. I think if they're alive in my backpack, at least they're okay. Definitely a good day for fiber, though. I wonder if there's like any ruined buildings or something like that to find in this game. I wonder if somewhere down the road too that fence is going to disappear and the world will just get bigger. The good thing about this game is you have to do a lot of the same things to survive. 
but it doesn't really feel like you're grinding it so much. It kind of feels more natural. I'm not left in a position where I'm dreading going out looking for things anyway. Definitely doing good in the meat today. Get this blood off me so no bears smell me. I think I ran right past some medicinal plants, but I was focused on the steel. Yeah, I might have to head back soon and start cooking some meat. Protein's dipping pretty good. Only eight nails, so it wasn't a good day for nails. Nice, there's some kelp. A couple of them. I definitely want to make something where I can be underwater longer. Ouch. It's making me go deep for this one. Don't see any more. There's a couple. Usually don't see this many. Got hung up on the ground. I wasn't gonna risk it and go for that one until I got some more air. I'm hoping that wood stove is a little easier to keep running. I don't want to have to keep making fire starters all the time, so... Hopefully it's a little easier to keep fueled up and running longer. Get my 
my fishing line ready for the night. That'll give me eight for trying to catch some fish. Hopefully some of them are big enough to eat. Well, now that I think of it, I should have used that liver to make some medicine. There's a medicine I think I need to have on me just in case I get sick. So I'll probably have to get another wolf or something just to make some of that on the side. Especially since I wasn't doing too bad in the meat department, I should have saved it. I will try to remember for the next time. Just because I remember now doesn't mean I'll remember in the future. Right on, I can make that now. Just watch that power and stuff get sucked right down. Oh, I have lockpick. Looks like it holds lots of fuel. Those bears are hanging close. Hopefully I'm safe in the base. Just rename this. Just noticed I could. Yeah, there's a fridge and stuff. It's all locked, but... I need to make my base a little bigger so I can put, like, some of those garden plots. And then hopefully the carbohydrates won't be such a big issue. If I can make bullets and stuff, I don't think meat will be a big issue either. It'll just be the staying alive part. I guess I need a generator to charge up my base unit. Yeah, it wasn't a good day for nails. I don't think I even have enough to make a foundation. No. Well, hopefully tomorrow's better. I did pretty good in the fiber department and the grubs. I always put this water bottle on my hot bar. I'm gonna have to see if I can just keep it in my inventory and fill it up by clicking on it. I gotta be careful I don't drink that dirty water. 
I imagine that will make me sick. And I don't have a liver. So I don't want to risk risk that. I'm gonna wait till it gets a little darker, I think, to light up that wood stove. I've already got this burning anyway. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to find nails tomorrow. At the rate I found them today, it will take me a game year to have an enclosed space. Oh, there was a locked chest up here. Now that I got that lock pick, I'm gonna go see if I can find it. Hopefully it doesn't get too dark too quick. It's getting darker already. I don't want the cold and the wet to make me sick. Well, at least there was a bag here. But it's getting dark fast. And I'm cold. So I'm going to head back to my base here. Get back to the fire. And I will look for a lock chest tomorrow. Hopefully it's loaded with some good stuff. But I am just going to fish throughout the night, try and get myself in a good position for tomorrow. And I'm going to end this one here. So anyways, if you made it this far, thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you in the next one, and have a great day. Take care.